Becky. Now here's a glimpse of the future for you. Computer software developed in Yorkshire is driving the first fleet of robots to be used in a British hospital. The robots will free up support staff and help reduce infection risks. Final tests are underway before the hospital opens next month. With the story, here's our health correspondent, Penny Buston. The robots are being put through their paces as part of last-minute checks before the imminent opening of a £300 million hospital in Scotland. Their performance, meanwhile, is being monitored 200 miles away in Wakefield. The software developed here keeps a big brother eye on them. We're hooked into the robots. We know what they should be doing, when they should be doing it. And our red, amber, green charts will automatically be flagging up if things have gone wrong. The same system will be used on handheld devices at the hospital to automatically dispatch porters and take food orders at the bedside. The firm's performance management system is already used in the Manchester tram network. The Scottish hospital is their first health project, but their fame is spreading. But we're looking forward to doing a lot more in health and similar opportunities like this. So we've already branched out overseas. It's in Chinese and the People's Hospital in Beijing are beginning to use our software this week as well. The Scottish robots will operate out of sight in specially designed tunnels and lifts. With dirty linen removed by one and fresh delivered by another, it's expected infection risks should be reduced. Penny Bustin, BBC Look North, Wakefield. OK, some sport now.